You need to stop cleaning your house right now. Are you tired of spending your precious time scrubbing floors, vacuuming dust, and cleaning spills? Well, what if I told you that there is a smarter way to keep your home sparkling clean without even lifting a finger? That's right, folks. It's time to rethink the way that we approach household chores. Today, I'm here to tell you guys about a revolutionary solution. Let's make AI do it. And no, this is not a joke. I'm actually being dead serious. Stay with me here for a second, okay? Picture this. Instead of spending your weekend chained to a mop, you could be out enjoying quality time with your friends and family, pursuing your passions, or simply relaxing without a worry in the world. And at the end of the day, what's the point of all of these AI advancements and all of these like robotics and stuff like that that we're building if we can't rely on them to do our cleaning? <laughs> Okay, look, so the number one question that usually comes to people's minds is, okay, fine, if I rely on this robot to clean my house, like, can I actually trust this thing to handle the job that I've been doing for so many years? The last thing you want is to drop money on an expensive piece of product, and then you have to clean up even after it because it just didn't work properly. The question is, do these robot vacuums actually work? The company Dreamy, who's very well known for making robot vacuums, sent me their latest X30 Ultra in order to check it out to basically see if this thing was worth it. The first thing that I noticed when I unboxed this thing was everything looks quite premium. I don't mind having this in my house or studio or out in the open because it looks pretty good. And Dreamy have also made this thing slimmer than before and with this whole blacked out look with golden accents, it's sitting pretty. Now the base station here actually holds both clean water and dirty water up top as well as a dustbin and cleaning solution and a docking station with a water tray. Now it has all of this built into it because this robot will actually go clean your house by vacuuming and mopping and then it'll come back and automatically dock itself, empty out the internal smaller dustbin into the larger one in the station, refill itself with clean water and soap, wash and heat dry the mopping pads so they don't smell, all while charging itself back up again. Now I don't know about you guys but when people say AI, this is what I want. <laughs> Now let's talk about how this thing actually works. So this little robot will actually use AI in conjunction with LiDAR and 3D structured light optical avoidance in order to help navigate and map your entire house. And this thing actually does a fantastic job. I was genuinely impressed with how good it uses AI and these other features in order to navigate and learn your entire house. Now, okay, they'll see. All of this is really cool and all, but how's the vacuum and mop? These are things that sometimes can be a little bit gimmicky and I totally get it. And I don't blame you because unfortunately we've seen our fair share of flops before, but fortunately you get what you pay for, which is also, I guess, kind of like unfortunate because it is pretty expensive coming in at about $16.99. But hey, think about it this way. When you're calling a cleaning service over every night to vacuum and mop your house, that's gonna get pretty expensive. And eventually this will pay for itself. Now let's first talk about the vacuum. Okay, this thing's got 8,400 Pascal suction power which is one of if not the highest that I've actually personally seen at least on any robot vacuum and that makes this the perfect robot vacuum companion for any house that has all sorts of flooring types including high pile carpet in my test I actually had no issues vacuuming hardwood floors tiles or carpets which gave me comfort that this thing could handle the job once my three children went to bed Okay, now let's talk about the mopping. The first issue with mopping is some of these robots will have like a mop cloth that they kind of just like drag around the house. It literally does nothing but move dirt around basically from place to place. But this thing actually has these motors that are spinning these mops and applying downward pressure. This helps with actually mopping your floors properly. The other thing is usually when you have these kind of circular robots, cleaning the edges and under things can be difficult. So what the X30 Ultra can actually do is extend its mops along the edges so I can make sure that it gets to the hard to reach places. So they call this mop extend robo swing technology and it's really cool because it will actually swing the mop pads out in order to get under crevices and into edges. That's actually pretty darn cool. Now the other issue with having mops and vacuum on the same device is what will it do when it gets to the actual carpet in order to vacuum the carpet? Because you don't want the mops like kind of just getting all slobbery and wet all over your carpets. 
So in previous vacuums that I've had, you actually had to choose which times you want to vacuum and which times you want to mop because you'd have to manually go and pull off the mops so it can vacuum your carpet and whatnot. Now in this case, the X30 Ultra functions a little bit differently and to our benefit. Now, if your carpet is low piled, then the X30 Ultra will simply lift up the mop pad so they don't touch the carpet while it's vacuuming. Or if your carpet is high pile, then you can go into the settings and set it so that the robot will actually go to the base, remove its mopping pad, automatically and then go back to the carpet so that it can vacuum it and then when it's done it'll go back to the base station again attach the mops back automatically and it can go back and do its mopping again that is really cool now all of this ai and robot goodness doesn't just end there once the cleaning is complete and the robot returns to its base it will automatically clean the mop pads and heat dry them this is to make sure that the pads are actually clean over time and they don't start smelling it will also clean the washboards docking area where the mop pads are actually being washed to make sure that the debris and stuff that are coming off of the mop pads are not just left there. Now, besides all of this hardware, you also need solid software to run everything. The Dreamy app in this case is actually quite capable. You can see the entire mapped out area of your house. You can remote control the robot and you can even get a real live video feed if you're out of your house and you just want to basically jump into your robot, control it and go check out your plants or you know check out the security in your house. So all in all, I think Dreamy have actually made a winner here with this robot again. Other than the price, which puts this in the premium category, no doubt, which I will say they do add a lot of features that other robot vacuums don't have to try to justify that price. And the fact that the base can get a tad bit noisy when it's cleaning the mop pads and stuff like that. So just make sure it's not like right next to your bedroom or something like that. But other than that, I think this robot does a phenomenal job at keeping your house in tip top shape on a daily basis. Vacuuming and mopping is something that takes time, but the results can really help improve not only overall health, but also your mental state of mind. And having something that will handle a large chunk of that so that your space is nice and clean every day when you wake up in the morning is a fantastic feeling. In any case, if you're interested in checking this out for yourself, I'll have it linked in the description down below. With that, I'll see you guys in one of these two videos over here. And uh, yeah, I think that's all I had to say. Okay, I'll see you guys there. Peace.